calling this little video just say no. I used to be a big people pleaser and it was hard for me to say no. And I ended up saying yes, yes, yes. And what happened was I ended up disappointing a lot of people and looking like a real jerk because I couldn't keep up with all the things that I had said yes to. Uh, I don't do that anymore. And it's very smart. And on top of that, I got to realize that I can't expect people to always say yes to me because they have other priorities. I'm not their priority, and nor should I be. But the reason I make this video is, um, once again, the time factor was distressing me today. And I just couldn't get anything done, and I got flustered uh, because I'm very... Um, what you would call prolific. I used to get a whole lot done in a relatively short amount of time and I just can't do it. So, but the priority, as I've said, is my time in prayer, my time with the Lord. That is the priority. And the day was getting away from me and I was getting agitated because I hadn't spent any time with them. I was trying to do this, trying to do that, trying to message this person, keep up with that. I had a visitor, uh, things were going on around me, all distractions. And these are things that sometimes we necessarily have to, to deal with. But bottom line is, a lot of it we don't. So I might seem ruthless when I say no to people. I'm always polite about it, but I'm saying no. Because right now, we just don't have the time for nonsense. That's why I've gone on and on about, you know, cutting down videos that aren't going to help you, videos that you're just watching out of curiosity. Uh, and you know how YouTube's designed. It'll, you'll watch one short video, and they'll throw another one. They want you to binge watch. There's nothing worse than binge watching. It's so wrong. It's wrong. It can become sinful because you're wasting time that you could be spending with the Lord or doing some good for the kingdom. So, yes, it can become a sin of omission. It can become a sinful habit. So, I don't care. I, I just, a lot of people are starting things, projects and things. Okay, that's their thing. I can't. I can't do it because my time's already limited. Your time's already limited. So, I'm ruthless about what I cut out of my day. I have to reprioritize every day. Well, the day's going quicker. I can't get this done. Okay, what am I, what am I going to is going to be my priority. Priority, sorry. The Word. Or doing some work for the Lord. Those two things. What else matters now? Because anything I do for the for the Lord now might help a soul. And that's important. That does matter. But I can't overextend myself. And you shouldn't overextend yourself. Because you won't have any peace in it. And pretty soon, you'll just, you know, you'll just get angry and irritable. At least I do. So, learn to say no. Do it nicely. If someone has a request for you that you just you know you can't fit it in, say, sorry, I, 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 I've got other priorities. I have other commitments. And if they push you to know what they are, I've got to spend time with the Lord. So do they. So do they. End of story.